Born in Salt Lake City in 1876, Moroni Mac Swain took an early interest in the theatrical arts. At the age of six, he created his own show called Mac Swain's Mammoth Minstrels. At eight, he stole all of the linens in the house to create his own circus tent. By 15, he ran away from home to join a traveling minstrel show. His mother caught up to him by his first performance to take him back home to Salt Lake, but he was adamant that show business was going to be his life. To that end, he ended up one of the most familiar faces in Hollywood. After a number of stock appearances, he ended up at Keystone, making many comedies with them. There, he developed a character named Mr. Ambrose, who would get into all kinds of chases, and most films would end up with him getting a pie in the face. He was also one of the famous Keystone cops. It was at this studio where he met Charlie Chaplin and how he got the job playing Big Jim McKay in the film he's still most remembered for, Chaplin's The Gold Rush. In it, he plays a down-on-his-luck miner so hungry he imagines that Chaplin is good enough to eat. Swain worked in Hollywood up until 1935 when he retired to Washington State and passed away that same year. Today, Swain's star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame can still be seen at 1500 Vine Street.